many of you here for this evening of celebration, not only a celebration of my wonderful brother Dominic's 60th birthday, but also a celebration of his music. Let's do feel free to interject with you. I can think of no better way to mark this numerical milestone than by lending us your ears for about the next hour or so, which would make it what? 60 minutes of music to mark 60 years? Seems, seems rather fitting. I got my first one. Oh, I like saying numerical milestones, but it's, it's actually a very important milestone because I gather that the older you are, the more important you become. I, I know, Sarah, it scarcely seems possible, does it? Of course, um, several of you will not just be lending us your ears, but lending us your voices and your skills of musicianship. Uh, which brings me to, um, to this programme. Okay? Um, please make sure that you have a copy so that you may learn a little of the background of each piece, see who is performing, and also to read Ewan's beautiful poetry. What's not in the programme is that once the music is finished, there will be a not so subtle change of mood and direction, because we might be having a few words from some people, and, and also advance warning. This evening also contains just a little bit of spoken poetry. <laughs> You're a good audience. Now, here's something for us all to ponder as we put on our audience heads. It's from a poet's perspective, an insightful take on music and her audience. It's from T.S. Eliot. You are the music while the music lasts. Well, it was either that or Abbas thank you for the music. I, I, I just felt that quote somehow that necessary gravitas for this occasion. And that is all from me for now. Please welcome to the stage area the members of Philomel.